hello and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how i make this quaker fish if you are interested keep watching to see the end product okay at this point my fish was already cleaned and marinated unfortunately i couldn't um take a video i think i forgot but at this point I, i've already washed my fish with lime on clean everything and adding my homemade marinade place it in the fridge for for it to marinate overnight so now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna add in a bit more of the homemade marinade into the cut because you don't, you don't want to make all that um juicy and yummy goodness into the fish so, so for the fish to to moisturize i don't know how to describe it guys but that's what i'm doing basically enough of the talking <laughs> Okay, now I'm gonna grill the fish. I'm just gonna place it on top of the baking tray. And I'm going to grill it for half an hour. And by the way, guys, you want to marinate your fish for at least a few hours. Don't just marinate it and place it in the oven. It will not taste nice. Trust me, guys. Leave it for a few hours before you... you you grill it for me i always leave my stuff for for it to uh, marinate overnight so now i'm gonna leave it there to grill once my fish is grilling i'm gonna make a sauce or some sauce for it i have one onion one tomato um three garlic garlic cloves and two scotch bonnet and some sweet pepper and oil to cook now I'm going to blend it all together. I like to make sauce for my fish, but it's up to you if you want to, if you have any kind of sauce. But for me, I like to make my own pepper sauce for my fish. So now I'm going to add in some oil. And I will leave the full um, recipe down in the description box below. Now we're gonna fry this for about five minutes. Add in my chicken stock. All purpose seasoning. You can use any type of seasoning that you have, basically, it's up to you. But this is what I normally like to use for my sauce. Some thyme. And mix all that together. Leave it to cook for another five minutes. Then your sauce will be ready. Nice and easy and yummy. Okay, now I'm just gonna add a little bit of water just to make the um, to cook the onions. And as you can see, our sauce is ready, nice and yummy. This is really yummy and spicy, guys. So if you like spicy, you will love this one. And now we're gonna check our fish. As you can see, nice. <laughs> nice green grill as you can see for me i'm so lucky i have a grill option so i grill my fish and this is the end product guys if you enjoy watching this video don't forget to like and subscribe share to your friends and family and come back for more yummy and juicy recipe from rahmatullah's kitchen thank you for watching guys
Don't forget to like. As you remember, don't forget to like. Support your girl. Watch out for my next video, guys. Bye.